A man dressed in liturgical garment kneels in a brightly lit space. Around him, a crowd has gathered to throw stones at him. The direction of his gaze and his attitude indicate that he is appealing to God. On the left, in the shadows, two horsemen watch the scene. The scene invokes the stoning of St. Stephen. Accused of blasphemy, this young, early Christian deacon from Jerusalem was martyred during the first century AD. His story is told in the Acts of the Apostles. Painted in oil on a wood panel, this artwork was acquired in 1844. It remained in storage in the museum for a long time. It was only in 1962 that Rembrandt's signature and the date of 1625, almost invisible to the naked eye, were discovered in the top left corner. It is thus the first known work by Rembrandt, produced when the painter was still strongly influenced by his master Peter Lastman, with whom he worked for several months in 1623 to 1624. Although the rich, dense composition is slightly awkward, the powerful diagonal created by the interplay of light and shadow and the narrative quality of the scene 